<laughs> Ezio. La Volpe. I'm surprised to see you. And why have you appeared at my door? Wait, I know the answer. You always do. You want to put my spies to work? Then join me. In aiding Machiavelli? No, thank you. That man is a traitor to our order. A serious allegation coming from a thief. What is your proof? He was an ambassador to the papal court and traveled as a personal guest of Cesare himself. I also know he abandoned you right before the villa attack. Machiavelli may not please all tastes, but he is an assassin, not a traitor. I am not convinced. Ah, he is meeting someone in the Trastevere right now. Care to accompany me? I will follow. What do you make of that? My son Claudio has been injured! They are going to shoot him. I will kill these. Go, get the others. Claudio! Molte grazie, Messeri. Keep out of sight for a while, Montesi. The guards are looking for you. I see they have posters up. Then rip them down. You can pay the heralds a few florins to silence them. Or I can eliminate witnesses. <laughs> you know how to disappear. What a night this has been. Volpe, listen to me. I know what we saw. But you have nothing to fear from Machiavelli. I am sure of it. I have you to thank for saving Claudio's life. If you believe Machiavelli remains loyal to the Order, I trust you. So, what of the thieves? We had plans to repair this old building, but... Now that you and I are working together, I would like to know what you think. We need to make sure the Borgias stay away. Perhaps it could look like an inn. Yes. Hmm, I like that idea. Then I will make it so. Welcome, Ezio, to La Volpe Addormentata. The inn looks perfect. No one will ever suspect its real purpose. The guild will be run from here. Visit me whenever you like. There might be objectives to pursue that will help our cause in the city. I see you thieves compete against each other. You can participate if you wish. Perhaps you will show them a thing or two. Ah, yes, I forgot. We also have gambling. It is a great source of income, especially since we ensure that the Borgia guards always lose. One last thing. I need your spies to find the apple. It has been taken from me. We are searching the city for it already. Molto bene. Come to Isola Tiberina with your findings. I shall. Ezio. You have need of my assistance. The thieves in Roma are young. Skilled, but young. Prone to rivalries. Another gang? The Cento Occhi. Cesare Borgia's bootlickers. They cause us significant trouble. Where can I find them? My thieves will show you. What have you discovered? That bastardo Cesare is in the Castel Sant'Angelo with the Pope. My spies tell me that the apple has been secreted to someone for a study. I am working on determining his identity. Caterina will be moved to the prison within the Castello next week. Bene. So the Castello it is. Roma will heal quickly with Cesare and Rodrigo gone. Only if the opportunity to assassinate them arises will I take it. Do not repeat your mistake in the vault. You must kill them now. I'm with Machiavelli, Ezio. We should not wait. Bartolomeo is right. They must pay for Mario's death. Do not worry. They will die. You have my word. Ezio... Where is Machiavelli? I could not find him. I brought the Contessa here. 
Caterina. Care to tell us where you have been? Looking for Ezio. What of Cesare and Rodrigo? Cesare rode off before I could get close to him, and Rodrigo was somewhere else entirely. That is odd. Rodrigo is usually at the castello. Very odd indeed. What a waste. No offense. None taken. With Cesare gone to Urbino, we must build our forces. I thought we intended to strike now. Impossible. Cesare commands a massive army in Romagna. You would never reach him. I say we work here, in Roma. Erode the Borgia's influence while restoring our own. And in fact, I want to begin right now. Volpe, bring Claudia and Bartolomeo here. Machiavelli, meet me outside. Take care of her. Where have you been? We all have our secrets. I took the liberty of setting up a means of communication with your recruits. We send orders via carrier pigeon. Thank you, Machiavelli. Bartolomeo sends his apologies. The French have doubled their assault. Claudia. Ezio. All right. I have a plan to deal with the Borgia. We can either go after supplies or Cesare's followers. My plan is to attack both. If we cut off his funds, Cesare will lose his army and return without his men. So, I ask you, where does he get his money? Volpe? Agostino Chigi is the Pope's moneylender, but Cesare does business with someone else. As of now, all we know is that he is called the Banker. I know someone who owes the Banker money. Senator Egidio Troche comes in all the time and complains. Bene. I will follow up on that lead. French soldiers are guarding the road back into the castello. Once Cesare arrives, you will never get to him. I intend to kill the French general. With him dead, Bartolomeo will have the Frenchmen on the defensive, and they will abandon their posts on the bridge. Even with those troops gone, the Papal Guard will continue to protect the inner gate. There is a side entrance. Lucrezia's latest plaything, Pietro, has a key. He was at the castello. Come see me later. I will have my thieves ascertain his location. Buongiorno, Ezio. It is time to pay a visit to Lucrezia's lover, Pietro. I've sent my men now to find him. Molto bene. Ezio, if I may... What is it? Someone warned Rodrigo to stay away from the castello. Machiavelli? Do you have proof? No. We must not be split apart by mere suspicion. The Borgia know the locations of our spies. Who told them? Maestro Machiavelli asked about our search for Pietro earlier today. Ezio? I still do not believe Machiavelli has turned traitor. First the villa attack, then the castello, and now this! He is behind it all! What were you able to find out? Pietro is to be assassinated this evening. Cesare sent his butcher. Did you uncover information about Pietro? The man is an actor, and he is performing in a play, Stanotte. What did you find out about Pietro? He is to be suspended from a cross. Nicoletto will come for him with a spear. Where is Pietro? I cannot tell you. But Micheletto waits at the city gate east of the Terme di Traiano. He intends to disguise his men to make the killing look like an accident. He will lead me to Lucrezia's lover. Ezio, Machiavelli has betrayed us. We would both wish to deny it, but the truth is now clear. Do what needs to be done. If you don't, I will. Without Volpe's thieves, I may require the help of my recruits. I have discovered the traitor. What? One of our men. He was at the villa attack. Here, he carried his letter. My god. This is good news. More than you know. I am once again in your debt, Ezio. What debt is there amongst friends who trust one another? Yes. Thank you for relaying the message in time. Come, Nicolò. It has been far too long since we've talked. I heard the Colosseum Passion Play took an unexpected turn this evening. Really? It seems Jesu Cristo was... 
resurrected three days early. Volpe, how goes Roma? Very well, Ezio. The French and Papal forces are in disarray. Then it is almost time. Call the assassins together. And bring Claudia. Now? Yes. All of Italia shall be united! And you will rule beside me! Come to watch my triumph! Soon Micheletto and his army will arrive, but you shall be dead before then. Insieme per la vittoria! Vittoria, vittoria agli assassini!